Hi friends, this is Ramya from Wild Turmeric. In this video, I wanted to share a very unique bath powder recipe that lightens dark knees, elbows and thighs very effectively. This bath powder is especially very effective in lightening blemishes and can be used even for children too. The ingredients used in this bath powder is a bit different from traditional bath powder recipes. The base for this recipe is barley. I know using barley in a bath powder might come as a surprise to many of you but trust me barley powder does wonders in lightening all blemishes very well I usually stock barley at home so I just use that but you can use red meat barley powder too this recipe can be used for both oily and dry skin just make sure to use the appropriate liquids to mix the powder like I have suggested at the end of the video this bath powder stores well for at least 3 weeks at room temperature if carefully stored away from moisture so even if you're staying in a hostel you can still use it take 3 parts barley in a bowl add in 2 parts white poppy seeds also called as couscous in hindi finally add in 1 part kasturi turmeric powder also called as wild turmeric now grind to a fine powder in a dry mixer It takes some time to grind to a fine powder so be patient while grinding once finely ground sieve it once and you'll have a beautiful pale yellow powder like this now store this powder in an airtight box and use daily to use take the required amount of the powder in a bowl now add in a squeeze of lemon juice Finally add an enough milk if you have dry skin or rose water or rice water if you have oily skin now mix well with a spoon to use take the paste and apply it on all the areas where there is discoloration and massage for a few minutes and then wash it off try to do this treatment for a few days regularly if you want to see results apart from using it for lightening scars and blemishes This bath powder can be used as a regular bath powder and face wash powder too. Like barley, we use white poppy seeds for skin care, especially for fading scars and blemishes. We usually soak it overnight in milk or curd and the next day we grind it to a fine paste and apply as a face pack. But it is so easy to use it if added in bath powder recipes like this. And finally, we all know how effective kasturi turmeric is for lightening scars. I found the proportion I've given to be very very effective so do follow the recipe is given for best results I hope you found this video useful if you like to support me in this channel please share this video with your friends it will mean a lot to me if you like to get detailed information on herbs on days I don't post videos press the notification button thank you for watching this video